Baby, comment below. Comment below. And let me know. It's the show. Bye, y'all. Do you mind if I call you on FaceTime? On the West Coast, so it's late night. I'm gonna make time if you make time. I'm gonna make time if you make time. I just. Mackie's about to get into this Sunday reset. You heard me? Let me stop. Um. Sunday mornings in our household normally consist of, I don't know why I'm breaking out right here. I think I got bit by something, but it don't look, I don't know, I ain't liking the way it look, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, Sunday mornings normally consist of salmon patties. Y'all know we love our salmon patties here. Um, I may be making that for break time. Today it's gonna be a hot behind week in NC. It's gonna be in the uh, 90s. In the 80s. Yeah, in the 80s, 90s. pushing 90s this week. So definitely gonna be out in the yard. Nice. Definitely gonna be out in the yard. Um, I wanna try this. Like I told y'all before, I didn't have the right uh, solution for my nails when I tried it on Nori because my kids are my little um assistants they let me try stuff on them so this is the slip solution for poly gel nails um i'm kind of steering away from gel x nails and wanting to learn the poly um my little cousin she's what 13 and does nails and everything so she's been helping me i still didn't get the nail manicure the little not manicure the um, mannequin for the nail i still didn't get that so um I'm thinking about popping these off. Told y'all that the other day. And trying these. This is a Sunday reset. So I want to do maybe a new set of lashes. A face mask tonight. Because today's going to be. A, well this week's going to be a short week for me. Um, I work Monday through Friday of course. But we are taking off Tuesday. Because Nori has a field trip. And we want to be in attendance. So I'll only work four days this week. And then next week of course. I work Monday through Thursday because we're going on our trip Friday. So, yeah. Busy, busy, busy. I have not did any packing. I ordered a couple things. I told y'all I was going to show y'all what I ordered. Um, I told y'all we were going to do it together. However, we didn't. <clears throat> I went ahead and did it. I ordered some stuff from the TikTok shop. Um, and, of course, she, she in. Got to say it right. And most of it's already shipped, so I don't know if it's going to focus. But I ordered, wait, is my address up here? Because, baby, to make sure everybody's stalking me. Anywho, um, I ordered Trey some slides. I ordered this cute little, this is so cute, y'all. This is so cute. So I ordered that. Um, Trey has some shorts. I thought these shirts were super cute. So I ordered these short shirts. Probably gonna wear the green one or the white one with the thing that I just showed y'all. Um, I do plan on having like a little romantic date night at the beach. So I ordered these. Um, I love the color. Y'all know I love like a green, brown, tan. I love colors like that. And then I also ordered some black flats because they are cute. How could I pass them up? And it's gonna go well with my um, what's it called, y'all? my black uh clear steve madden baby also ordered this joint shipment which is this is the bikini i want to find a hat to go with it i ordered this super cute the back is out um then i ordered this of course because my husband is crazy i had to get a cover up so this one comes with the cover up so it's like the thong and i do want to be respectful i'm a mama i'm not out in the streets no more so cover up my goodies but this is what it's looking like it's kind of like the khaki sand thingy and then i'm gonna wear my shades from the um from timu um i also gotta order some more stuff off of timu because um i got some more uh on the influencer side, I want to order some more stuff. Got some more points. So, and then this is the final piece, which is the cover up. I think this is super cute. You see that? So, yeah. That's what I ordered. That's in place. Um, I'm probably only going to take 
Well, I know for a fact I'm going to take my Steve Madden um, duffel bag. I'm going to take that bag, well, tote bag, the big one. Um, and then I'm going to take my luggage, um, the one that rolled. Um, and then I got one for my shoes and his shoes and all that good stuff. So we should be fully loaded, ready to go. Room is paid for. Um, I hate that it's only for three days, two days, but I am planning on going back and maybe june or july maybe june because we're doing that's a whole nother, other story so june i want to go back and take the kids and maybe stay a little bit longer but um july we are having a so the weekend of july 4th we're gonna have like a 90s party so y'all gonna have see me talking about that and i'm a 90s baby but i was born in 93 so i don't really remember like the 90s era so i was trying to do like a 90s party slash early 2000 party like mp3 players the ipods the cassette tapes um things of that sort so i need help okay i'm gonna need y'all to comment below help me out with this 90s party because i want it to be the party of the century okay and i need my i need my subies to help me i did find something on amazon <clears throat> let me see if i can show y'all um it's like a y'all know the backdrops on the 90s where Somebody be at the bottom down there like this, and people be over there like that on the sides. I like the little prison photo shoot. Anywho, it's something like this, but not necessarily like this. So this is more like graffiti. See? So this would be the backdrop that I want to put up for everyone to take pictures and all that good stuff in. And when you think of 90s, you think of like the big, is it called Dickie Chains? Um... TMI. I don't know, but that's what it's called, I think. And then, like, the graffiti. I don't know, like, salt and pepper run DM DMC type thing. So, um, yeah. I, I think I wanna. Oh my gosh, y'all. I'm up here showing y'all this. Look at this Steve Madden. Look at this bag. While I'm over here looking up 90 stuff, this might be my new friend. I'm gonna save this. Screenshot. Tray over there, like he ain't getting nothing else. Ain't that right, baby? What? I see a bag that I like. It's a Steve Madden. It's $105. Yeah, okay. Okay, just said okay. Thank you to Mommy Mommy Anywho, let me get in here and I did a poll the other day and I asked what y'all want. Babe. Mm -hmm. I did a poll and I asked what y'all wanted to see. And y'all said um, cooking, cleaning, and day in the life. So I'm kind of, I'm trying to make two videos. This is more so like the day in the life. And then I'll put like the cooking and cleaning type video out. Um, I do listen to my subbies. I do listen to the Mackies. So um, yeah, keep your girl right. But please definitely comment below on the whole 90s party type thing. So that I can get the um, examples or whatever. So I can, you know, kind of feed off y'all and go to I'm also going to do my research and look up, you know, 90 parties. I don't want to copy nobody, but I want to get some kind of ideas. Because I want this to be fun. And we're going to incorporate um, fireworks as well. So, yeah, y'all. Let me know. Comment below. Let me know. Because it's a show. Let me know. Oh, my God. It feels so weird picking up my camera because I've been away for a while i feel like i mean i've been posting but not day in the life type things um i'm getting back on my ish okay um right now i am cooking some baked beans in the crock pot y'all they look amazing so those have been going for a while now and let me show y'all let me sit y'all here for a minute y'all i'm about when I say about tipsy, this is a weekend vlog, baby, and your girl is feeling right. Do y'all hear me? Wine and a Corona. Um, so we are cooking on the grill tonight. Hey y'all. <laughs> that wine got me through already. Okay, I couldn't even open the foil, y'all. I'm so through. Um, we have um, I'm fucked up. Uh, mushrooms, <laughs> um, zucchini, squash, peppers, and onions that we're putting on here. So we have about three of these. Um, kebab. Then we have. <laughs> Shut up. 
I'm getting a little tired of your broken promises, promises. Looking at your pages, seeing different numbers and numbers. That's gonna be the intro. Y'all, I can't, okay. And then we have some corn. That good old fresh grilled corn. We're cooking that, I have two of those. And then the girls are having, they want hot dogs, of course. Something bare minimum and simple for them. Me and Big Daddy, we are having steak. These are the Angus steaks. And these the big boys has been marinating since this morning. That smells so good. I topped it with some, is it Worcestershire? Worcestershire, 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 whatever. Y'all know what I'm talking about. That sauce. Um, I topped it with that. And these are ready to go. And then I also, made some pineapple shrimp kebab so um basically what they are you know it's the fully cooked shrimp that you can just put on the grill i left the tail on because on the grill they just i don't know it falls off anyway um and then i added some pineapples and some paprika and a little bit of seasoning to the shrimp so that is what dinner is looking like the girls um they were in the pool today so they had their time in the pool they're currently outside right now. I'm going to take my camera out and show y'all. Y'all, your girl. I'm over here stumbling, baby. Y'all, did I tell y'all we had this bad windstorm come through, knock my freaking umbrella down. I got to buy a whole nother umbrella. The umbrella I bought was like $79, $80. So I got to go buy a whole nother one. Damn wind. Uh, anywho, I'm stumbling. So this is what we looking like. The grill is going. He has his baby show you well you can't show the yeah. but he has his drink i'm sipping on some wine we got the fire pit going and the girls are over there on the trampoline Mommy. well i know you're not on the trampoline girl your knees look like browns they ashy also look y'all we have some tomatoes coming up already on our tomato plant see Look at the little bulb. I'm excited. Um, I didn't even read the thing. It says it has to have um, full sun. So it harvests in 40 days. So about a month and 10 days, right? Anywho, so I'm ready for that to harvest and get right. Um, didn't do too much today. Like today was very chill um switch y'all here but yeah today was very chill um for once we didn't go out i didn't spend bookers of money per usual i just really chilled in the house as you can see i got my bonnet on i'm just chilling enjoying life um yeah that's pretty much all i did today just sat around um and was outside when the girls was in the pool i gotta show y'all i'm gonna post a short probably or add it into a clip but um, Haya actually got in a pool because last year she was kind of nervous because, you know, the water and everything. But she actually got in it, y'all. She did. So I was excited for my baby. But Big Daddy is ready for me to play some music. And, of course, I couldn't do that while I was talking to y'all. So I'm about to head outside. I will pick up my camera a little later if I'm not too. Because I'm already where I don't need to be. So maybe I need to put the wine down. <laughs> later. What is up y'all i feel like i haven't talked to y'all in forever i've been putting out vlogs but not as often as i normally would um y'all i've been exhausted overwhelmed and exhausted um where do i start so work has been killing me literally killing me um school i had to Y'all know I tell y'all everything, okay? You gonna come to my channel, you can get raw, real, and uncut. So, I literally had to withdraw from my course that I was taking, which was statistics, because it just became too much. It was overwhelming, so I needed that little break. So, I don't go back to school um, until my next course, which is marketing, and that's gonna be um, May. Um, so, like, yeah, y'all, it's been a lot. I had to really decompress um i had built up stress and i just i just needed a break overtime was kicking my butt like the girls extracurricular activities 
my baby's going to another school next year so we have to go visit dad nori has a school trip thursday next tuesday so i have to take off to do that y'all already see where, where it's coming wig looking like god knows what right now um i'm not gonna i'm well i need to order a new wig i'm gonna keep this one on until i order the one for the beach i've been looking at one however i don't want to just buy a wig like because the one i want is 30 inches right and i'm i'm not gonna wear something that's down to the crack of my bo booty daily y'all know what i'm saying like i'll do like a 28 or something like that but um 30 is 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 pushing it so i mean i really want that for the beach and i'm debating if i want to just buy that for the beach or like special occasion type thing date night i don't know but i don't want to wear it just for that and then be done and i'm about to spend like 300 dollars. you know what i'm saying y'all make it make sense so and that is what i have going on um what else was it i needed to tell y'all um i have okay back let me go to the trip first i'm trying to get everything together y'all say it today is friday baby and when i tell y'all i'm dressed down to a t i got the rug red 90 baby for sure i got the um sweatpants on y'all ain't nobody i'm chilling um but sticking with the beach situation so we booked our room and everything um it is a vacation so we're gonna stay for that weekend but i also took like two days off of work because who wants to go to the beach and then have to come back and go right back to work i ain't doing it i ain't doing it so um i do want to because trey needs some more like beachwear swimming trunk type things he needs some more of those um baby i done have four kids and i ain't, I ain't about to be out here in no two-piece without a cover up i ain't trying to cause no accidents and scare nobody with my tiger claws so i need to find me a cover up i think i think i'm gonna do sheen um yeah sheen sheen whatever i think i'm gonna do her because i looked at some and i found some for a pretty reasonable price so i was like i'm just gonna combine his and mine and i'm gonna get that order today because i need it to be out you know before we leave and you know how long they be taking so i also want to get like some small travel size things that we're gonna need granted it's only an hour away but it's still an hour away he is currently y'all my tag i've been running around dirty my tag's been dead for what what's today 12 days <laughs> they went out in march so he had to go get the um the vehicles inspected and um i gotta pay for the sticker online and all that but before i go to the beach because baby they be acting up down there ain't nobody trying to get arrested for no um bad registration because my mugshot mugshot would not be pretty not if i have to take this wig off <laughs> would not be pretty so yeah that is what we kind of have going on um so i'm gonna do some ordering tonight i made vlogs so y'all can see you know kind of what i'm like looking for or whatever not that y'all can help me out because this will be out after i send it i mean after i purchase it um and another thing my mental health y'all so for those of you that are new um i do struggle with anxiety so diagnose generalized anxiety and i have a separation anxiety um disorder and y'all anxiety is real so we're gonna talk about it mental health is real and i'm not one that's like there's no shame in my game if i have it i'm like that's that's life so um that was another reason i kind of pushed back from school because what i can't do is become overwhelmed i want better for myself you know what i'm saying y'all i have goals right i'm not just gonna be stagnant in where i'm at that's that's unacceptable but i also cannot overdo it to the point where i'm panic attacks and falling over because literally that has happened before so i've been taking walks um around the community so because i work overtime like tuesdays and thursdays i try to do them on like mondays and wednesdays so and that's like when we don't have ballet as well speaking of ballet i got some more stuff to tell y'all about that but um what was i saying yeah my walks <laughs> so walking around the community i think i do like 15 because i do have it on my um apple watch uh so it kind of counts the time 
So I do 15 minute walks um, every other day. I know it's not like baddie central where you out there working out, sweating and all that, but it's a start and I'm not necessarily doing it for the body portion. I mean, that's a benefit. Don't get me wrong. Um, but I'm also doing it for mental health. Like, you know, that clarity, walking, having that space. I also want to get back to like consistently journaling in my devotional or journaling about my day my goals um and I also want to get back better with planning so like I've been away like I've been posting videos but it ain't been like FaceTime videos like I feel like I'm on FaceTime with y'all on FaceTime with my sisters so yeah I want to I want to start doing that I want to get on a schedule with YouTube like this weekend is literally going to be a reset of like just organizing and prioritizing things that I need to put in place so that I can have like a smooth week and all that good stuff. So that's what my focus is. That's where I've been. Um, I could feel myself slipping into, and I feel like as African American people, we don't talk about depression or anxiety. Um, that's the one thing that like growing up, you know, it wasn't talked about in my house. However, it is a huge factor and I wish I was a little bit more educated on it. Um, like I, I did at one point feel depression creeping up and I was like, hold up, like I'm not cooking no more. I'm ordering out and I'm like, okay, now my health is at risk because we're eating fast food every day. Money's going to food all the time. Um, and I had to think about my kids, like they're healthy. Like I don't want them, you know, be big backing and all that. Like we ain't got time for that. So, and y'all, I'm just speaking, you know, facts. What is on my nose? I gotta get another nose ring. Nose be peeling. But, yeah, y'all, I just wanted to, like, generally come to y'all and have a FaceTime talk just to let y'all know, like, what's been going on. Y'all have always supported me. Um, no, I'm not giving up on YouTube. I'm not leaving YouTube. I'm not giving up yet. Let me stop. But, um, yeah, I just really wanted to focus on me, life, and family for a while. And I feel like I can give y'all more of me once I, like, have that that time so that's what's gonna happen this weekend um i don't know i may do some type of like girl time or something or maybe just family time i don't know i don't think i'm going to get my nails done i done told y'all i'm tired of going to these people and giving them my money okay so i ordered the um nail set off of um Amazon for the because they have different gel sets now they got like the gel X I've mastered that they have the poly um gel nails and that's the one that I want to get proficient in so I'm going to utilize what I have and what I ordered and I tried it out on Nori's finger y'all and I had the wrong um slip solution um that comes with it y'all why my baby finger was on fire it wasn't on fire but it was smoking I felt so bad like, cause she had, I had put the, um, acrylic on, um, the solution or whatever. I put that on and then let her stick it into my gel X kit, like little, um, cure set. I smell something burning. I was like, what is that smell? Like, I'm not cooking nothing. Like what the crap is going on? Y'all, she put her finger out in the nail. I mean, it didn't affect her real nail. Thank God. But like literally the, the, um, tip was like smoking. When I tell y'all, I, I didn't know what to do. So um this weekend trey is going to go and get me a y'all know how they have the little nail thing that's shaped like this y'all it's literally shaped like this so um he's going to go and get me one of those so that i can practice on because he told me straight up no you ain't practicing on my kids no more period i was like okay daddy so i gotta go get that and play around with that and um, before I do a record, I'm not going to do the first recording on YouTube for y'all to bug out on me. It ain't happening because I know y'all be in the comments tripping. So, um, I'm going to just wait and do my first set. But I am going to do it before the beach because I need to know if I'm actually going to do it right before I go out there looking crazy. So, I'm going to pop these sets off probably over the weekend because, I mean, they ain't too bad, but they, they can be popped off. So I'm going to take these off this weekend and practice. And then I also need to do a new set of lashes. But don't get me wrong. These, I put these on 
three three weeks ago, I want to say, because I was on the phone with my mom, and they still on. Ain't nothing missing or nothing, baby. So, yeah, y'all, that's what I had going on. I feel like I, I feel a little better talking to y'all now, like getting all that off my chest. It felt, it felt good. So, I'm about to get up and. I don't know what the crap I'm about to do, but I'm about to get up from here and not get lazy and probably get my butt back to work because I'm on my break right now. While I'm talking about it, I ain't got nothing to do. Bye, y'all.